Jerry Throckmorton. I'm a social studies teacher here, and my schedule currently is ninth grade uh, world cultures. And we've always been blessed uh, when I first came here with a huge percentage of people that have been here for a long time. Um, a lot of young people now, we have a much younger staff than we, than we did when I first came here. And I'm blessed there are eight or nine teachers that I have as former students that are working up and down the hallways here. And so those kind of traditions and that kind of um, community continuation, I think is, is one of the keys to our success here. I'm Jenny Rodel and I teach math at Sissonville High School. Yes, I started teaching at Sissonville Middle School um, and then I this year have moved up to Sissonville High School. Um, so I've actually got to see all of my students now be from the middle school to the high school. Um, the seniors this year were my first year I ever taught, so it's kind of like coming full circle. And I've been able to really see how like the paths that my students have chosen to take. Uh, it's funny to see what they think they're going to do when they were with me in the 8th grade versus what they're doing now. Um, so I have a lot of kids who have taken that Ben Franklin Carver uh, track and it's really cool to see that they, some of them already have a certificate and are working on a second one um, and then I've seen how some kids are now in like three math classes uh, which is really awesome and they're really preparing for that college uh, experience. So. Well you know I just think you need to take advantage of your opportunities I mean if you want to be successful in life you have to have some knowledge to bring to the table you know I try to tell these kids all the time look you have to develop a skill that's going to give you a successful life so pay attention in your classes, gain what you can out of it, and then try to get yourself focused on something that's going to take you down a career path so that you can, you know, take care of your family, keep a good roof over your head, be a good citizen, uh, live the life that you want. And the only way to do that is knowledge. My advice to a senior or really any high schooler would be that uh, keep an open mind what you think you're going to do right now might not be what you do in the future. Know that if your options do change, that it's okay. Uh, they don't have to stay the same. Your dreams can change.